Hello there, here and today we are going to play True Colors Specified, Chapter 1 and 2 demo. We are probably going to play Chapter 1 only for this one and then Chapter 2 for the next episode. Either way, I didn't expect a cat, honestly, at the title screen <laughs> for the game. Because from the screenshot I see, it's very has a very different vibe. I don't read the game description, so I don't know the plot, but either way, yes! We are here. So, yeah, let's play the game, shall we? Begin. Oh, kitty kitty kitty. Psst, 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 psst. Meow. Ah. Very long ago, before anyone or anything ever existed, there was a blank space with absolutely nothing in it. No life, no ground, no sky, and most importantly, no colors whatsoever. Interesting plotline. It was perfectly sealed off with no way to enter or exit it. That is until... The sealed cage was destroyed. It was broken from the outside, allowing anything to get in. The nothingness came to, ab to an absolute end. It was no longer needed. Oh, you can see like a rift broken there. That's a cool. The world finally needed to have some form. It was waiting so long to be taken care of. That's why the first thing to be created was colors. Nothing will be able to exist without them. Interesting. A power. <laughs> Sorry, I got reminded of Undertale immediately. A powerful being appeared in the middle of the nothingness, suddenly splitting its power into smaller containers. Each one of them held a different color and possessed an un unimaginable amount of power. Using its gift of creation, the being had managed to form a perfect vessel, a body. A body that would look modest but powerful, maybe even dangerous. Like, okay. Interesting. The color have shape and form until each one of them had a full physical appearance. The body that he created before would now be useful to them. Their appearance would become as important as them. They had horn, wings, tails, bright eyes, apparently. They look like everyone else in the world. Oh, okay, so that's a normal thing. Alright. That's how the first devils were created. The start of the demon race. The gods then used their power to form life, the ground, the sky. Everything that was missing got created new. They were unstoppable, they were creators of their own paradise. They were free to make whatever they want they ever wanted. That's nice. However, but okay, no however and but. It is a blessing for us that some of the highest of gods have decided to create us. Revige, Revige, Rev. Ooh, look at that! You're telling a story to a child there. That's why we cannot turn against them or dis disrespect them. Uh, spoiler, spoiler alert! You can. This sounds like a. This sounds like one of those thing going on, you know, with all the mysterious things in the background. Ooh. We secretly control the, control the society and, uh, what do you call it? Help the status quo. Hmm, good question. Sir, are they really that powerful? Of course, I will deny to you, will I? You see, it's more complicated to explain to someone so young. You might not be old enough to process it all yet. I remember something about sure. It was interesting, so I tried to understand. I see. Then remember the powerful being I talked about just a moment ago? Yeah. I do. It created all the colors. That's right. I'm glad you can recall that. All the white, black, red, purple are black colors. Are white colors? I honestly don't know. Good question. Orange, green, blue, yellow. Uh, have I missed something? Cyan, red, cyan, cyan, 
whichever you say it. Did you say blue? You did. You did say blue. Did you say red? Did you? Hmm, I don't remember. Green? Cream? Hmm. It doesn't matter much now. Let's focus on the big... Oh, maybe invincible colors like those in the rainbows. The ultraviolet. Are those colors? Hmm. It still exists up to this day, but it doesn't have a physical form like the rest of creators. That means we cannot see it. We can only feel its presence. But isn't it like the most important? It's say that once all the gods use their power, they'll be able to create a vessel for it. And we'll finally be able to see the most important creator of our world. The true color. No? Are, are, are we not doing title drop? Or reveal? Alright then. Is that what happens at a yearly ceremony? Maybe. Yes, the yearly blessing ceremony. That one occasion when the whole world is at peace. Because of their collective role as the vessel, the gods cannot engage in war at a time. But okay, so you're telling me the gods, the gods are engaging in wars all the time? <laughs> Alright then, gods. Uh, either way, look at that. I didn't notice the scales in the horde. That's a nice detail. I kind of love that. You don't have scales in your horns. Interesting. I wish you could go see it once. The war, the god, the festival. Now let's come back with some sweet and rare things. But for now, I want to know about the colors to the VG. Actually, what do they even do? I'll explain it to you in a moment, sir. Ooh, interesting. Well, Lafka is the name of the white god. They have created peace between every living being. They give hope to every demon to make sure that no one will be misguided. Oh, I love, I love this. Mar this is amazing. Marvas, the Black God, was a creator of war. Not to be mistaken for the opposite of Lefko. How would someone mistaken that? This is a very strict God. Actually, maybe you can. Who knows? Maybe the truth is much more deeper than you thought it would be. It's a very strict God that will not give up without a fight. He created weaponry and shield that level, let everyone battle equally. Battle equally, my ass. I think all it creates just more oppression, you know? Arms race. Re Refugee, could you please come down for a minute? I need some help. Oh, I'm sorry, sir, but I will have to finish the story later. I'll have to tell you more, trust me, but I have to get to go help Mom out. Ah, your siblings? Don't worry, I'll remember where we left off. My memory is really good. I'm glad to hear you say that. Now wait for me here, won't you? So are we going to have a tragedy moment in like 10 seconds? Chapter 1. A Foretold Meeting This is the main character. Ah, we are controlling you. Araswalk, Z-Space, Intrank, x Mini. This is so far, so... Oh, this is so good. This is such a good experience so far. Now saving. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, the movement is kind of... I don't know, it, it feels kind of stiff, like we're sliding on ice, but that's fine. Where's the door? Oh, okay, that's a problem. I don't see where the door is. Maybe that's the door. It's kind of blending into the background. This is where I keep all my books and notes. I don't write here, though. I like to go outside to search for inspiration. Cool. Safe. Who I absolutely enjoy this. Oh no! 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 Okay! It's a toy box. I keep certain toys and mascots here. Could you take out my music box and play it? Your music box? Wait a moment. Here it is. This is so nice. Yay! I'll put it back now. 
Okay, same same dialogue. You know, I, I'm enjoying it, so that's not a problem. Oh my god, this, there's a lot of people working on this. It's insane. <laughs> And then, then mm -hmm. it's nice. Huh? Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, it's a setup we can untrick that. All of my clothes are here. Your clothes are here to search, sorry. They take the lower cupboard. I have to remember to keep the curtains closed. Why? Is search something that needs to be kept secret, or search needs not to see what is outside? There are crimes inside my night table. Above are some search drawing, some of search drawing. One of them shows us together. I sleep here. It's not the most comfortable. I'm getting too tall for it. I have to curl up at night. You can sleep on the floor. No, seriously. I'm I'm just like saying like you have so much floor space. And you don't have to deal with the bad, what do you call it, frame. You just can put up a mattress and it's all good. Also, I don't really know why people sleep on bed top. Like, hmm. Uh, I accidentally click it twice. Try and, okay. What, chair? No, not chair interaction. I love how the chair still embodies a physical space. It's kind of uh, funny. Uh, we already interacted. That. What was I going to do? I assert. I wonder what mommy called one. Don't worry, I'll make sure to tell you about it once I return. When will you return? <laughs> I don't think it, there's anything else. Let me see for a bit. Oh, wait, wait, there's a detail. Interesting. Is that the door? Uh huh. Uh, the clock. Give me a moment. I don't know, the sun feels like it's coming from the left. A little bit to the left for me. It's a simple chest of drawers. Mom's favorite flowers stand on it. It's in a vase she received from mother's ones. From her mother? The light shines bright from the window. I can see my neighbor houses from here. Interesting. You, you see the difference? Like, this is big window, huge window, open and lit up, and the other window is not. It's a bathroom. I did not use it right now. Are you sure? Are you sure? Maybe, maybe you're being, you you want to go to the bathroom right now. The clock is ticking. It's swelling in the silence. I mean, I'm already feeling the silence. Maybe you don't need the clock. I feel I feel betrayed. Okay. It's my mother's room. Oh no, I wasn't intending to go there. No response. No one's in there right now. I still enter. I, I, I was terrified. I thought that was a person that was just a plant. The light from the window shines brightly. It's filling the whole room. There's some clothes inside. I want to look through all of them, though. That's a box laying on the drawer. Dresser. Lots of dried flowers inside. I've always wondered what those paintings meant. It's just a nightstand. This is the bad mom chose for her and mother. Excuse me, I'm sorry. So, it wasn't a type or something. Like, I thought it was her mother or something. This one is a mom and mother. It looks really comfortable. Fascinating. No? There's two desks, which is an interesting detail. Is that a mirror? That's a mirror. I can't see myself in the mirror. Oh, this game is so nice, but like sometimes the, the detail, like the objects are just too blending in 
the background, but it that that does look nice. Like I'm just afraid like there will be times when we are trying to find uh, you know some specified object and you can just you just miss it because it was so ooh, that's so nice. It's so tiny. Vice. Vise? Vice? Which one? Whichever it is. Mom, you call. Ah, oh, oh yes, I did I did call you. Sorry, Vijay, I'm still not used to cooking while mother is away. It's um it's so much more for only a tiny bit of food. Do not worry, you're still doing your best. I know that mother will be happy to you gave it your best attempt. You took the initiative and worked very hard, try to get some rest now. Mom, mother. Thank you. I I naturally did my best with making dinner today, so I hope you and Sir will enjoy it. So could you maybe take this to portion and bring one of them to your brother? Of course. I bet he's really hungry. That only means he will enjoy eating it more. You're right. I hope he doesn't mind that it's not his mother making dinner this time. I'm sure he won't even notice. Thank you again, Mom. Uh, oh, one last thing, Refugee. I... I overheard what you've been telling, sir. About the gods and the colors and everything. Yeah, indeed. And I know that you enjoy writing your stories. And you're doing your best. But there are some things that he shouldn't know about. He's still so young, and you know in what situation we are. That's fine with me. I'll give him less detail in the future. I should simplify the word I used to. I'm glad you understand, Rafiji. Now please, go bring the food to your brother. And don't forget to put him to sleep after... Hello. Mother, I assume? Oh. <laughs> oh I love this character. Yes, I do remember her. Oh, you bastard. Uh, Adam, are you okay? I sure am. I'm feeling the best I have in forever. Look who I met on my duty today. Come on in. Good evening, Miss Vice. It's a pleasure to finally meet you face to face. Uh huh. It's not a pleasure for you, apparently. Adam, would you tell me, at least tell me, exactly who that is? No. This situation doesn't seem good. There's something off with Mom's behavior. I'll stay and watch just in case. Or we can go up the stairs and deliver the food and just lift this bee. I hope Sir can wait. Did I read that? I forgot. I have never introduced Sarah to you, right? I met him before I even knew you. I had visited his village with my parents when I was just a kid. The memories just came flying back when I saw him again. Although it was hard to recognize you with his new look. It's nothing much. I've I've been places. But I'm glad that we met again, Autumn. It sure is great. Would you want to stay here for dinner, maybe? Mm -hmm. Am I not the one to say that? I was the one to make dinner after all. I didn't expect any strangers to come by. Oh, Devert says not stranger, we say. He's my friend. Oh, you're not going to make me starve our children, are you? <laughs> oh, interesting. Uh, that's kind of that's kind of lovely, but also funny, but also terrifying at the same time. What's happening here? Probably I don't know. Obviously not. I think maybe there will be some leftovers. Well, I've ran out of meat. It'd be a shame if our guests wouldn't get any wool in it. I'm sure that there must be some alternative, though, isn't? Ugh. Uh -huh. So, maybe come by some other time, Dirtsy? I'll make sure to be brain enough for one more person. 
Sure thing. Have a nice evening. Come down now? Just uh, like I thought, mom was in that strange state again. It always happens when she sees mother and another person getting along too well. Oh, okay. She doesn't act like herself. Hi, sir. S sniff. <laughs> okay. Oh, why, sir, don't cry. It's not your fault. I made a kid too excited to see him again. I wasn't really thinking. I... I didn't mean to. Yes, I know. You never mean to do it. You can't control it. You don't have to be worried about it, alright? We went through so much together. Uh, awesome. I... We'll oblige us to your friend. I promise you. I'm sure it do will get along this by today. It will be fine, I'm sure. At least the issue resolved quickly. I'm glad they don't fight often. Mom really can control her behavior for some reason, yet we all accept her, her how she is. Whatever will happen, we will never abandon her. Even if she thinks like that. Right, Vijay. Thank you for helping Mom out today with Sir. She looks exhausted. No problem, Mother. Although I still have to bring him his, him his food. Maybe it's a bit cold now, but... I'm so sorry, Vijay. I tried my best. It, how, how is it already cold? This is like 30 minutes being in here. Maybe you'll leave us alone for now. I'll make sure that Visa feels a bit better. I'll be the one to make dinner tomorrow, alright? If... if he insists. Visa and Autumn leave the kitchen and go to the living room. Fascinating. Living room? So far I'm loving this game. Outside. Freedom! Okay, that's the front door. I don't have a need to go outside right now. Cool. Can, can we go out through the chimney? Ho ho ho. I still have no idea why we have four seats, because there's four people? It's usually just the three of us sitting here. Oh, okay, fine. I mean, your sibling sits upstairs, right? Nothing special. The remaining preparations of dinner. The cupboards above are filled with all types of plants and bowls. Maybe even cups. I could go visit the backyard through here. So I don't have a need for that right now. <sighs> I can see her back here from here. I love the light lighting there. Ah, yeah, the character position change. I didn't even realize that until now. There are a few pictures here. <laughs> oh. This one is pretty old. Sir wasn't even with us at the time yet. Indeed, indeed. That's lovely. Are you all are you two enjoying your time? Uh -huh. He has two kids and a loving husband from what I have heard. I see. It's not so different from us after all. <laughs> indeed, indeed. Yes, I, I know it. I know, right? It's just that he seems a bit grumpy. I'm not troubled with that, though. He's still a good friend. Are you talking about the Ritsu? Yeah. Yes, she's telling me a few things about him. Um, he doesn't have any children your age. His oldest kid, kid is just a few years off. Eh, don't worry, we won't try to make you befriend him. Mm hmm. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. Gay love for the win. Lesbians. Right, help, I keep clicking accidentally because I'm trying to skip, I'm dying. How do I skip faster? Oh, there, there we go. Can we? Cool. 
Okay. Bye. <laughs> enjoy your life. That sounds like they're about to die. Uh, enjoy your time. And live a happy life. Okay. Can we go to the bathroom now? That took long enough. Are you gone? Are you still there? You're still there. I am back, sir. I've brought you some food. Yay, food! And I'm a refugee. Um? There was a lot of noise downstairs. What happened? Oh, mother came home with a friend. Things got a little... out of hand. The food might be cold because of that. I'm sorry, sir. It's fine. I'm more, more worried about mommy. Don't bother yourself with it. They've got it under control now. I wonder if mommy even gets all weird sometimes. I've only heard about it from you and mom. Is it really that bad? I'm glad that you've not seen it for yourself, but... Hey, should I continue the story for you? I'll make it more understandable. Yes, I'll listen to you while I eat. I'm glad to hear that. Now then... Ooh, more stories. I always love more stories. Sometime later... Oh, no more stories. Uh... For some time later, this is kind of weird. An empty space? Where is this? Is this a dream? Did you just fall asleep while telling your story or did you just get transported? What? What? How? I'm surrounded by pure white. There's no one here. I can hear my steps either. Well, it looks like a void or the emptiness, but it clearly isn't empty. I was about to... Comment on the whole floating thing because well it looks like an empty space, we still can see stuff. That means it's not entirely empty, you know? And there was someone there. Who was that? Shall I follow it? There's nothing else around here anyway. Oh whoa, whoa, I just got the report that scares the shit out of me. I looked under the emptiness. I know this is a dream, but I'm scared of falling off here. Well, that's a wall. <laughs> oh, interesting. That's a wall. Oh, we... <laughs> that's the wrong button. Uh, there's no, there's no auto sprinting, so I just have to hold the shift button. Hello there. Is that a gun? Does it want me to come with it? Okay, it's not a gun, at least. I'm still not sure if this is a dream or all, it feels so weird. Do, do you have cookies? Something? Food? Do you have games on your phone? Oh! You have wings! Uh, come on, let... Let's go. Go? Go where? I can't even say a word to him. What's going on? I can't communicate in any other way than gestures. Cool question mark? Huh? It feels like he's really there in front of me. But isn't he just my brain creations? Am I not making this up? Isn't he imaginary? Uh, your you two are just going to hold hands for a while. Where is he taking me? This really is just an empty space, there's nowhere to go. It's not like some buildings are going to suddenly appear in front of us. Oh, three, two, or anything in general. Okay, I was about to count down because <laughs> that would be funny if there's a cut and suddenly there's just a building in front. I don't think I've ever seen him anywhere before. And as you say before, you might say this is an empty space, but you do explain, oh, that's nice that we keep walking. That there's walls and there's cliffs. I don't think I've ever seen him anywhere before. As in the real world, of course. 
Where has my brain taken inspiration from to create such a form? The stories you made? Does he even have a name? A family? A life? I will ask, but I still can open my mouth. It feels like I'm saying this, yet it's, it's all just in my mind. Or is it? Does the blue-haired boy hear me speaking? Is this... Really even a dream? Mr. Mark? Do you... Do you know who I am? Well, don't worry about it. I... I'm your friend. You are, are you? Chapter 1 complete. Would you like a safe? Yes, I do. Oh, okay, this is interesting. Chapter 1 isn't that long, so the question is... Dreamland C. Hmm. The question is, do I want to continue with Chapter 2? Or do I just want to, you know, end the game right here? Interesting. Esther. Very interesting. Is that the cat that we see in the title screen? No, it's coming off together, maybe. I don't know. But look at that. Holy shit, this is such a cool background. Esther, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Where have I seen you before? Meow, meow, meow. You look hungry. And thirsty too. I wonder if there's something that I could give you. I don't have any treats, but I might have something else. Meow. You're a friendly one, aren't you? I swear if this whole chapter just makes me go meow 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 all the time, I will end myself. Let me get you, go get you something then. Chapter 2. Cat's Perception. Are we playing as the cat? Please, please tell me. Okay. Ah. Like a... F Oh, those are logs. I thought those were cactus. <laughs> oh, I absolutely love that. Tomato? Well, if you get some fresh vegetable over here in the garden. I know you will like to eat this, right? <laughs> just like... Just, just like I thought. Maybe there's something else around here. Oh, is this... It's a dead hand. Just... Being there? It doesn't look like anything bad happened to it. It's just not... Moving. It's... Rebel belonged to the Nightmare. Hey, would you like this instead? Well, couldn't you tell the neighbor first? Like, okay. Meow. Meow, meow, meow. Meow. There we go. As you will get her soon now, I shall go get some water from the well. Wait for me here, friend. Let's see. Oh! The well is in the opposite way. Interesting, I didn't see the door there. Yes, I said before, like, it's it's all blending a little bit too well. The well is not this way. This is so cool. What the? Is there something blocking us from walking there? Oh, look at that. Oh, I don't immediately want to go to the well, you know, like, I want to explore it around. Fascinating. Oh, that's a well. Okay. No? Not even any smidge of interaction? I forget. We can run. 
That's really helpful. Music choice is just nice. Here's the mail. Press. <laughs> Wait, what? A mini game? Oh, do not spam. Just follow the route. Now do the same to get it back up. Okay. D? Okay, it's just loading. I got the water now. Better get back before the cat goes away. Nice! Where did you put the water in? Are you going to trip or something? Something will happen? A tiger will suddenly jump out, out of the left side? No? Pull. <laughs> what is the cat doing? What a kitty doing? I'm back. Are you still here? Oh. I'm glad you waited for me. Here, I've got you a bucket of water. I'm sorry that you didn't get milk or anything like that. At least it should be enough, right? You'll have a lot of fur. I'm almost all covered in it. <laughs> Esther, come home. Oh, it's my mother. Excuse me, little one. I'll be back shortly. Hmm. Interesting. I'm back home. Hello, daughter. Cuff, cuff. Hello, daughter. What are you doing outside? Sneeze. Choo! Sorry. What? Oh, yep. <laughs> oh, no. It's a large I think it was like some sort of dying mother trope. But, oh, well, why are you covered in cat fur? Mother, are you going to be alright? I'm sorry, I forget about your allergy. This is going to kill me. I haven't felt this unwell in ages. <laughs> what can I do? Can I help you anyhow? Change your clothes. Yeah. Get over of yourself. Come here. Yes, mother. Esther, please, promise me not to play with cats game. Especially with wild ones, you know how much they could harm you. How much? This one looks so hungry and thirsty. It looked like someone had abandoned it. I had to take care of it or else it would... Esther, listen to me. You're simply not allowed around any cat, no matter in what state it is. Any animal that has fur is not allowed near you, me, or this house. Or allergy? Yes, mom. No, dear Esther, someone has to clean the house while I'm gone. Okay, this means in the sauce for his band, sadly enough. I'm leaving the job to you any better than we did before night time. The whole house must be sparkling clean. Right, mother. Say, say. Good girl. I'll bring you something back in return. Now go get your prawn and place it down in the laundry room. Freedom! No? Not yet? Can we move? Okay. Well, that didn't go how I expected. I guess I will never see my friend again. Unless... Okay. <laughs> no unless. I'll go clean now then. It should be, shouldn't be too hard. No, not yet. Okay, so loading. I was like, pressing s Yes, freedom. Mom told me to stand clean. And even if I wanted to, I can go back to that cat anyway. I hope it will stay in the garden for a bit longer. I was like about to- s I was spamming like the arrow key to go down to run to my freedom. Fascinating. This doesn't have any character in it. Which is like very interesting. Just a basic shell. Shell. 
There's three of us, so we have three chairs at the table. We don't have many guests. If anything, Mommy and Jill sits here and look at the picture placed here. Oh. Apparently, they from before I was born. She looks so happy. The clock is quickly ticking. Quietly ticking. This is Mom usual sipping pace. She often ends up pulling slip while reading books. Sleepy head. Me, 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 me. A bookshelf with some of my mom's favorite books. She has way more of them in her and that's room. This window is placed so high to see the garden from you. All the cleaning supplies are stored in a special closet. I won't find any here. Why? I mean, prob probably just to... I don't know, I feel like... Uh, for me personally, like... Having cleaning supplies near the things you're going to clean... Can I can I not go there? <laughs> I'm fighting for my life. Before I go to the closet, I shall go down and get my cleaning dress. Uh, what was I about to say? I prefer, like, having things I used to clean near... The... Are you serious? Who- who dis- What the- What the fuck? Okay, then. Who designed it like this? There's a bunch of old furniture here. It always creeps me out whenever I come down here. I guess there's no electricity yet. Or is there? I don't know. There's a bunch of old furniture. Okay, it's the same thing. Yeah, it fucking creeps me the fuck out as well. Don't make the music cuts like that. That's even more horrifying. That's the laundry room, huh? The door is locked. That keeps some work coming here. What is that? Is that the clothes? Oh, that's just your footstep. That's what I'm hearing. I was like confused. <laughs> okay then. Alright, now I need to go get the cleaning supplies. Woohoo! Uh-huh. <laughs> he also changed clothes. Hmm. Interesting. Return. This painting scares me. It looks like a half face of a clown. What is happening? Is this a window? I think that's supposed to be a window. It's the bathroom. I don't need to use it right now. Hello? Why am I Well, it's time to clean. Oh no, you still want to explore stuff. I got everything I need. Along with the of things I have to do. Dutch oh my fucking god. That's shelf, wash the dishes, clean rugs, get all the clothes, so shelf, dishes, rugs, clothes, laundry room, wash clothes, hang clothes dry, put the clothes back, and what's the last one? In the rooms. Why is it a little bit smidgy? Oh, okay then, we can do this first. Clean shelf! Clean shelf! I love that there's an indicator. <laughs> that, that's so helpful, actually. I shall do other chores first. Interesting design. Why is this room so small? Clean shelf. Washes the dishes. Clean rocks? Rocks. Hello. Can we go here? 
Get all dirty clothes. Oh, this is a laundry bin, I think, like, from the wardrobe. That makes more sense. I need to carry this down the laundry room now. Pretty simple. Well, there isn't much left. I like to take a break, but if I do, I'm gonna get myself to come back to this later. So, post washed, dry. Oh, okay, we cannot do it from this side. We have to do it from this side. I don't know why. Hang clothes to dry. I mean, you can take a break now. You don't need to wait for the clothes to dry, don't you? Hmm. Oh, is it a kitty? It something hits against the window. But that's... Uh... <laughs> okay. Where am? Hey, hey! Nice my dress! You look gorgeous in it! Too gorgeous! What are you doing here? Why are you making fun of me? I will punch you. Am I now? You're the hottest demon I've seen ever since last night. Mm hmm Wink. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, you wish you could see your face right now. Like I've said before, I don't want anything to, to do with your love life. Oh, I'm very much offended that you've refused to do it with me before. Hmm. Now if you change your mind, you've got the to wear this dress specifically. <laughs> oh my fucking god. It's not happening, you're just my friend. You're no fun, boo-hoo. What even are you here for? As you can see, I'm busy cleaning the house right now. That's boring, you were supposed to go with me and Mohan in Avenger. Scythe, you're not 12 anymore and neither am I. Stop being so childish. Well, we are not 19 yet either. We've got a lot of times before turning into adults. So just come with me. I'll be fine. Promise? Come on, you don't want to make poor Maho sad. Oh, Maho. You know that I have to finish this. My mom will be very upset if she sees the house dirty. I've been spying for a bit now. Looks clean enough. Come on, don't you want to have a little bit of fun? Hmm? You can say no to me if I get back up on the window and pull you out through. through oh, sorry. You can say no to me if I get back up on the window and pull you out through it. Let me get out of the stress first. Woohoo! The trip is not cancelled. Hooray, baby! Let's get out of here and close the window. You think I was finally changing? Yes. Absol absolutely. I'm not that much of a perv. Huh. Yeah, sure. Or am I? Go, go, go to fuck away. Go to fuck away. I'm, I'm pressing charges against you. Get out. Yeah, yeah, alright. <laughs> alright, you shall be waiting outside. What the fuck? Okay then, sure. Hmm, I wonder if there's things we can interact with. I remember there's things over here, so yeah. What gives? No, nothing. Nothing we can interact with. Very interesting. This is your room, why is it so big? The plant seems to be doing fine. It will get some water later. Every week's here to the light. This is the bottom row, the rest belong to my mom. This part of the closet belongs to me. While this one belongs to my mom. Interesting. I sometimes feel like my bed was made for someone else. It seems to be too big. Yeah, it does feel like it's too big. 
It's humongous. Fascinating, isn't it? It has been too chapter and we still gotta go to the bathroom. What is this? What is this gatekeeping? I can't leave this. I should have saved. But oh, hey, I forgot. I'm sorry, Mom. I mean, you only need to do one more chore or stuff for that, so it's fine. I'll be back home soon. Are you? That's a question. Oh, so you're Moho. And that's a kitty cat. Well, we are back. You're here, Moho. This cat look in need of attention. It, it really see here. I'm so glad I think it'll be gone by the time I've returned. Meow. Well. Wait, it's not yours? No, not actually. Where was it when you found it? I saw it in front of the house when we got here with Warren. I thought it belonged to you. But, but now that I think about it, your mom has an allergy, right? She does. Wait, so this was a wild cat for all? Yep. Oh, you know that I'm supposed to be taking care of you right now. It, it's surely uh, harmless. Harmless or not, if you get rabies, then I'm gonna be the one to get punished. We're gonna have a long talk tonight, I promise you. Just, just talk and... Be quiet. Rats like you don't have the right to speak if not ask. It's lively with them around, as always. Oh, let's go, finally. I feel like it's been a year since we have last been to the forest together. How does the story in chapter 1 and chapter 2 connect? There's indeed a connecting character here. We indeed haven't been there for a while. Some fresh air sounds nice. Yeah. Not forgetting about the old little creature. Can we name it? Don't get attached to, attach to some cat. It's gonna run off at some point anyway. Hmm. It might stick around for a little longer. At least, at least I hope so. Let's name it Philos. 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 Sounds friendly. Mama. We'll be on our way then, Philos. You never listen to me. You could obey me once in a while. Hmm. Not into that. Bye, Philos. Meow. Are we going? It's still looking at me. Why is that? Meow. You have to say bye. Just say goodbye to it. You can disrespect it like that. <sighs> Alright, fine. Goodbye, Philos. May Carlos lead you away. That was mean. <laughs> but I did say bye. Hmm. Meow. Let's move finally. Gosh. Meow. Coming. Uh huh. Interesting. It's the forest. This forest has grown a lot since we've last been here. At least there's still a visible path. Are you sure that we're not going to get lost? Nah, there's no way. Me and Asa make a great duo, especially when it comes to adventures. We even made a map of this forest when we were just kids. Quit it with the stupid comments. We only got in more trouble every time we walk around here. It can be that bad, can it? We're much older and stronger now. Hmm. And we have Maho to be our mid shield. Maho, no. What, what? I didn't agree to that. Hey, you come here, you sign for it. There, there's no need to agreement. It's in the fine contract, you know. I'll be fine, Maho. That won't be happen. We're going to be very careful. Just follow me, Lee. Yes, mom. It's ma'am. Sheesh, whatever. 
whatever. Where and mahal follow behind Esther. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Wee. <laughs> oh my god. The sign says Deity Forest. Cannot enter during hunting season if unauthorized. Well, duh. Luckily, it's not. It is not that season yet. Phew. I mean, it's scared to go there if it was. Hmm? Was that just a random space? Um, weren't we supposed to go to the forest? No, we're totally where. Turn back, Etsy. Etsy. Okay then. Hey, not going back now. What a shame. Save time. I almost remember to save. Uh, my suggestion probably would with the save system is that there's an addition of like uh, automatically going to like, like last a save file or like the save file after the last save file so you can just quickly save stuff or reload your file easier all these paths are blocked so we have to go straight very unfortunate considering that we're all queer here <laughs> So do I have to remember the path? Wow, a big tree. I've never seen one like this before. It's not really that much bigger. It feels like it didn't grow at all since we've been last year. Probably because we grew it here. At least it brings back memories, doesn't it? We've about tried to climb it before. Uh, r r really? Weren't you too scared? Did, did you do survive? Well, I personally wasn't. Tell him, Esther. Esther. I had to get help her get down because she was shaking too much. Hey, shush! Shush, shush, shush. Alright, well, let's proceed. There are way too many bushes over here. I could ask Warren if she has a knife, but it's better we take the known path. Excuse me? Cosmo, are we going to interpret the... Strange. I remember there being only pa one pathway here. Oh. Yeah, she's right. We haven't gotten north before. Maybe we should check what's up there? I don't take the safer path. You know, so we don't lose ourselves. But what's the fun in that? Let's explore. Do we have a choice to make or what? Make my choice. Make your choice. Yeah, see, it's better if we have the access to uh, immediately saving to the next safe spot. That'll be perfect. What's this anyway? Forest path. Probably will be best to go there. Seriously, it's just a boring path. It's not boring, there are some berry bushes around. These are edible, right? Well, I'm sure we can bring some back. Let's be sickling them before eating. What are we going to make? A jam? Come on. I do like jam. Let's just collect some since we are here already. I mean, was it a choice? Interesting. Very interesting. Very sunken. In. Hey, Mo. Uh, oh, hi. Try to only pick the vibrant berries. Are the dark one bad? Well, if they are darker, there's a high possibility that some bugs have already roamed inside. Uh, bugs? Why do you live so far? Maybe you should go get the bears instead. Okay. <laughs> Are you okay, Moho? Bugs. Oh, poor Moho. I cannot fucking go up. Uh, okay, that's probably another thing that needs to be addressed. <laughs> the pathing is so precise. 
Is that a pass? That's not a pass. What an interesting berry places. Uh, most of this has been eaten by animals. It's alright, there's plenty of bushes around. Even if we don't get much from our one bush, we'll get enough bears to multiple. Yeah, alright, nerd. You are always like this, little nerdy nerd. Alright, alright, I'm picking these berries. Maybe there's something better on the other side. T too slow. Alright, I think that's all the bushes around here. We didn't get a lot from here. Are you sure it's enough for a gem? Is gem the only thing you talk about? Well, I will admit that we didn't have our harvest much. Maybe you could bake some cakes instead? I'm sure that will lend us a hand. Yeah, like last time when we tried to make an apple pie. Without apples. L listen, Mila Blooms look almost the same. <laughs> okay, okay. And yet they taste bitter. Is Mila Blooms a real thing? That could even swallow it properly without squeezing his eyelids together. Alright, alright. We have to carry all of this berries home now. Let's go before it starts getting late. Question mark. Is this a path? What is that sound? Oh, it seems like a path from before let's see here. You're telling me just now. How was I supposed to know? Maybe I could get back through there then? You might as well. And don't you dare say no, Etsy. I guess we could go back. What was written in the sign? Cool, we made it. But what is this place? Didn't you read the sign? I think I have time to look at that. Ah! Oh. Look! This is like a bunny paradise. Bunnies? Another kind of animals I must look out for. Ugh. Let's move. I want to pet them all. Those are furs. Maho, don't know how. Uh, this time I won't be so polite. After him. One ish. Bunui. What the fuck? <laughs> There's so many Bunui. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Bunui. Get the fuck out of the way. It's blocking the way. Do something, Asa. What exactly am I supposed to do? I don't know. Make it move. Hmm. Let's allow the vegetable from the garden, I guess. Should have said so immediately. Let's leave them away with food. They're just bunnies. There? They're in the patch? No? Oh, oh, hello. Get the fuck out of my way, bunnies. That's interesting. That's an interesting mechanic. There we go. Now let's keep going. That's... That's the light. Interesting. Can we just ignore you? Yeah, we can just ignore you, apparently. <laughs> Interestingly enough. Oh, so the, so the bunnies are still blocking my <laughs> our way. Maho, don't shout, you'll scare the bunnies away. Look at how they're playing near the water. I like this place a lot. The most dangerous thing you can do in a forest is to run out like this. Oh, so sorry. I just got really excited and I've never seen actual bunnies. Were you sleeping during class or what? They teach you about animals pretty early on. I think he meant, well, whatever. We shall get going, or the street will turn into night in the woods. Hey, that sounds scary. As if me and Esther spent half a night in here and nothing happened to us. We almost got attacked by a bunch of wallops. Wallops? Uh, Alright, let's move. Hi, bunnies. Hi, bunnies. Interesting. Very interesting. Are you not? <laughs> you're not blocking our path anymore this time, huh? 
I say we're in my hug of the first part, first, first path again. That's strange. Why do we get return here? Um, there seems to be two paths over here. But neither of them are marked. Come on, what's the hold up? I guess we'll have just to pick where to go. From what I remember, there was a river nearby. And? And there was only one bridge. Well, my amazing navigation skills tell me, tell me we should go further north. Uh, are you sure? I think we should take the path we just missed. Do you know what? What if we try to go back first and then we explore further? Uh, Esther, I don't think there's no need to go back. Right, sorry. No? Bunny patch. Okay then. Alright, let's take the road that is. Wait, now we immediately go there. Hmm, that's interesting. Here. See, I told you. You. I guess you were right. Really? Hmm. Don't worry, Maho. Alice seems to be a nice fishing spot. Yes, sir, yes, tell me, tell me you're actually into fishing. Oh, wait, it is. It is like, well, like, like what, uh, where on said. The wrong path, I guess. I know that that used to take matter here. Is that? Sorry, I'm fine. Come on, let's go back on track. Fascinating. Look at that, I love it. The animation. That is amazing. So going up then. Wonder why we cannot just go back then, or can we? Alright, finally back on a good path. I guess we are. Let's be careful, this bridge is quite old. Ah, is this where it will continue? But what? Will it not hold our weight? I think it's safe to pass together. Okay, so is this where things are gonna get a little bit weird? Like rich. I don't like the sound. Okay, good goodbye. Okay. I was about to say goodbye, Maho. What the I told you to be careful. It's not my fault that Maho can walk. You, you are trying to shake the bridge on purpose. No, uh, isn't that all your fault? Hey, it's fine. We shall be glad no one get hurt. Now, come on, let's proceed. Oh, uh -huh. okay. No, not yet. Saving. Why is this area has what's being cut? Okay, now we get returned to the earlier saves, which is like, hmm, weird. But anyway, why is this area being cut? Is there something that I need to worry about? Ah, that's a lot of bushes. Hey, look. It's a bunny, one like just we've seen before. But why will it just be here? Good question. Is it just a bunny? The patch is far, far behind us. Maybe it got lost. Hey, lost or not, we shall probably just ignore it. You've had enough of them today already. But I really want to help this one get back home. It's really far away, its family is probably worried. Uh, you never listen to me. Hello there. Let's just go. We are wasting time. Maho, what? Oh. Bunny. What do we? 
Done. Move. Probably just a hundred, though. Well, that's a problem. Them. Those bloodthirsty demons. Who are you talking about? Rap Rammers. Rap Rammers? Is that who just did this? There's a village nearby, I'll then be surprised if they went for a hunt here. But it's not a hunting season, so why? I'm so confused, I wanna go home. I'm scared. Uh, yeah, it's kind of traumatizing to see the bunny just die in front of your face. I could have got shot if you didn't warn me in time. Maho, it's fine. Quit overreacting. Man, why are you always such a crying baby? He hasn't done anything wrong. Stop bullying him. From what I know, he's my brother, not yours. Oh, oh, wow, okay. I see how it is. Probably you will then see me in, a, in, in an apron then. Sebui. No, oh, I'm sure that it didn't mean any harm. Rewarders have to live such a lifestyle. So, come on, let's have a walk while explaining everything. Interesting. This is certainly longer than chapter one. And of all the gods, there's a creator of blood, Rebram. Since our family has only prayed to Corollas, we don't need to make offerings. Rebramers, however, the people who worship Rebram have to offer blood. But, but what if they didn't offer anything? Well, they will certainly have their lives taken away. If the whole community does not contribute, their consequences might be drastic. The god will punish the ones who misbehave and went against the rules. That sounds so strict. I'm glad we, didn't live, we don't live there. I know, we can consider ourselves lucky. Continuing, the Rebramers have no other choice but to offer animal blood. But what if it's just not animal blood? Hmm? So... So that's why someone will kill such an innocent bunny. <laughs> yeah, totally. Precisely. Actually, I'm glad they didn't go for us instead. What do you mean? They could have us use us as offerings. No, no, I don't want to be sacrificed. Calm down. They only go after new newborn spear blood. Don't scare us like that, then. Where, where on? Where are you? Giving you information is just so tiring. Unless I hope that I explain the situation clearly. Um huh. Where on? I guess some demons have it worse than we do. I only care about the fact that we are safe. No, that making you come along would make this trip trip twice as exciting as that. I will need advice you not to come here without me at any point. As uh, where on? Also, uh, you miss the sure miss. <laughs> I missed the thing back there. There's some sort of tower or something. Sure, miss miss now it all. Huh. We are so far away from home. Oh, that's the sound of us walking. I was like wondering what, what those rustling sounds are. Something in bush? No? Oh. There's a lot of forest being cut. This is dead end. Oh, uh, dead end. Why did we go here? A dead end. This wasn't here before. I say you sure you got the directions right? I don't know. I think we are going the right way. Did I focus too much on talking? Are you, you saying we are lost? No way. We never got lost before. The forest has clearly changed since we last been here. And how did 
Now. Now, an ambush. Interesting. What? 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 What's going on? Oh, you're asking. You really wants to show up in our, our territory. You got really here to become a sacrifice. Yes, so did you just say this guy didn't go after teens or adults? You'll never lie, would you? I I thought they didn't. It's none of your business's blood we take. Is there something going on with your place? Because clearly it's not a hunting season. Your all seems desperate. Come on, let's get them and feast. Father will reward us greatly for this plenty of blood. G get away! Oh, okay. Hello there. The red suit. Dad. Oh, okay. So I was like wondering in the first chapter that this dirt's your dad, and then here it is. Go. D dad? I said go now. Go! We can just go pass through the bush. We. What the hell? What is this pathing? Hello? Hello? I'm trying to find the pathing. This is. Oh, we just need to follow the dirt path. Okay, I see it now. This is so, so confusing. Dude, what the fuck? Imagine if there's something chasing us, I will like shit in my pants. It's my pants. That sounds better. Ah, oh, that's a huge tree stump. Huff, huff. Hand. Are we far enough? Yeah, my legs are from running. Don't complain about that. We, we barely get away. Is that going to be okay? We just left it alone with the suited guys. That is probably going to be okay. I think that's going down with a par fight. I say no chance. He works in the army, doesn't he? He should be fine then. Oh, hello there. Oh, what? Another one? No, no, it's not like that. Damn you, go away. Step back or I'll use my fighting skills. <laughs> I'm in no harm, I swear. Oh, really? Weren't you weren't that your pals that we almost got slaughtered by? My my siblings? Sorry for them. They've caused you a lot of troubles, I know. A friendly rap rammer, is that even possible? I mean the, the rap rammers back then hunts bunnies, so yeah. I feel the only thing I'm good at is tying people up anyway. Wait, are absolute are absolutely you sure you are good? I I think they are telling the truth. I am. Could you please hear me out? I'm Jaeger, and I'm a rap rammer. Yes, but I only went out to hunt for animals, not demons. We, why are you all so quiet? I feel like you've seen us before. How would you even know we are here? H have we seen them before? Yeah, the bunnies. The bunny. They've been following us for the entire time. I... I'd rather have them kill an animal than us. I can explain, I really can, just let me. Uh, just go on. You're acting worse than Mahadus sometimes. <laughs> Why are you bullying Mahadus this time? Scythe. Scythe. We Rep Rammers are going through a crisis right now. Everything was normal and the people just suddenly started dying. They fall in a garnal pile and colorless. Huh. What's going on there? N none of us know. Our suspicions were directed toward the numbers of sacrifices. 
So that's why you're out here. Pretty much. But don't get me wrong. Even if it means a bad life to me, I will not call another demon. Seems reasonable. Why are you here though? You all didn't follow us without a reason. D to make sure no one else tries to take your blood. You're just children walking around a dangerous area unsupervised. I can leave you alone. And so that's why I'll do my best to get you out of here. No need, we already know our way home. Uh, oh, y you do? Yeah, we have our guide right here. Actually, I don't know where to go. We we are lost. <laughs> see, 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 see what? Wait, no, seriously. We are in a completely random direction. Where? I don't recognize this area either. Would you really help us out? Uh, of course, I know this course very well. From here, it'd be this way to the Carl's village. I'm assuming. Oh, off we go then. Toodaloo. Bon. <laughs> okay, that's your dad again. Guess that. D dad? Is that you? Oh. That's waiting for us there. D dad! We're coming, D don't worry. Scythe, I'm glad you're finally back. I had to send your father to look for you earlier, are you alright? Yes, J Jagger saved us. Jagger? They helped us when he got lost. Y yeah, he was just behind us. But there's no one without with you. Uh... Where did Jaeger go? Maybe he got scared or returned home already. Maybe he just doesn't want to be seen. Or maybe Jaeger doesn't ex exist in the first place. But wait, but we didn't get to thank him. Maybe that's for the better. Well, in any case, you should be more careful next time. I never expected you to come and play here. We we should probably talk about your other father, your father being attacked right now. But Dad, we've been to this forest many times before. That was in the past. You may not remember the area well now. If not for this Jaeger that you speak of, you might have got seriously injured. We are sorry, Dad. I know she'll have taken a map of this place with her going. Oh, you're fine. Oh, Father's here too. Uh, the are you fine? Are you hurt anywhere? Bon, it was just a bunch of kids. Oh, you are bleeding from your cheek. Even a bunch of kids could have hurt you. I'll check you up, up at home later, alright? Thank you for saving us. It's... it's nothing. We should start heading back. I'll escort your friend to their house. Thank you very much. Yeah, so shall we get going? Most likely. It's all happy ending? Alright then. What's with the cat then? Fascinating. Chapter 2 complete. Would you like to see you? Sure, why not? Ah, this is a very long story. They're going for a lengthy storytelling. I'll, I like it. I like it. Kind of different from what I usually see, but alright. Hello. Hello. Okay, there we go. This view. Train station? No, it's a market. This world looks so small from up here. It is so distant and yet so detailed. Every element has. What the? Okay, why is it skipping so fast? It seems to be completely impossible. Rather time wasting. Wait, did I accidentally press a button that just makes me skip? <sighs> Fucking hell. Is there a button like that? That's so funny. If there is. Who are you? Thank you for playing through the test version. More com to come in full release. Absolutely. See ya. 
Special thanks to Derek Azoi, Tommy, Safi, Defok, Defun Kun, Philip with Blue, Orlonic, and Rashad Evolution for testing the game early. See ya too! Interesting, so there hasn't been any revelation of how it connects, but that's good enough for me for now. So, what do you all think about that? I think it's just amazing, like the the art style, everything. Uh, maybe a little bit. I feel, I feel like sometimes, yeah, you know, like the background and the way that we're supposed to go are blending too much. So sometimes it's confusing, but also like. Uh, where was I trying to go? I will then try to go back to the path because I, I, I think there's nothing that we could explore there. Actually, let me try to go back. So we'll just we're just being sure if there's nothing that we can go back there through. Is it around here? No, I think it's around here, right? Yeah, it is around here. Can we go back? No. No, we cannot. All right then. So yeah, as I see, as I say before, not see. Uh, oh, we can also check the dialogue that we missed somehow. I don't know how. Right now. But yeah. Uh, other than like the problem with the blending in, the, like it's hard to determine which stuff from which stuff the game is like amazing the art style is cool the world building is huge and i'm just interested in the story like where are they going the world looks so small from up here it is so distant and yet so detailed every element has its place in this universe And yet, when you wish to look for a specific one, it seems to be completely impossible to find. Rather, time wasting. And there you go, go back inside. Alright, that's what we miss. Uh, where was I? The music choice is great, the story is interesting enough for me. Uh, but what else? And it's just something that. I hope we'll develop in, into something amazing, you know? Like, this this has a giant potential. By the way, yeah, that's all for True Colors Specified. Interesting title, the specified part. See you all later, then, in the next chapter, the full rest of the game, or whatever, or maybe in my next video. Bye-bye.